Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Um, it's going to be a Q&A. We got uh, a few questions on Instagram a couple of weeks back, so finally got around to answering them. The boys, they're, they're away just now. Simon and Gabs are back from their, their wee skive break. <laughs> virus and that. Yeah, so Luke and Tom are away, they're getting some R&R, &R, so I thought we would do a wee video answering some questions. First question, who is he? Straight to the point, I like it. My name's, yeah. my name's Harry Stoltman and I'm wanting to get stronger and become a strong man. That's basically it. Third Stoltman. <laughs> People didn't know there was a third Stoltman brother. Got two sisters as well, so quite a big family. Does your little boy like strong man? Wee man is almost three, so he doesn't really know what strong man is. If he likes strong man when he's older, then fair play, but I'm not gonna force it onto him. Detrimental thing to push your your kind of stuff that you love onto them, because then they just, they'd probably just kind of rebel and go the opposite way, you know? So if he likes the gym when he's older, then, then I'm gonna support him, support him with anything he does. Does the pressure from people on the internet to be as strong as your brothers affect you. No, it doesn't. Uh, pressure is a privilege. I don't really get affected by it. I've never been pressured by Luke or Tom to do strong man, go to the gym. I found that kind of by myself. It's just a massive help, a massive advantage that they are as good as they are, you know? It's definitely benefited me. All the kind of attention online, the messages, the comments are really inspiring. I have to say thank you for everyone sending me messages and all the nice comments. It's it's unreal. It's kind of mind-boggling, actually. What prescription are your glasses? <laughs> <laughs> so I was born with, like, really bad eyes. Pretty much legally blind. I cannot see I'm legally blind. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just tell you, they're, they're really bad. And I can't get laser eye surgery, can't get um, the contact lens, the permanent contact. It's not really a choice that I wear these. It's not a fashion statement. <laughs> it's a necessity. Yeah, I'm not gonna tell you how bad they are, but they are. Just take my word for it. Would Harry come to Liverpool and go on a date with me? Um, probably not. Not because um, who you are, but uh, <laughs> I don't really do the dating thing anymore. It's not my thing. Uh, I'm quite happy just chilling by myself. I'm not interested in the whole dating thing. Maybe one day, we'll see. Will you wear those glasses in competition? <laughs> As the previous quick question is my eyesight. I need them, so I wouldn't see why I wouldn't wear them. <laughs> It'd be an interesting competition. <laughs> what does he do for a living? Work full-time now worth with Tom and Luke, uh, Stoltman brothers. I do all the merch side of things, look after operations up here when Luke and Tom are away, because they're away quite a lot, competitions, filming. Um, before that, I was offshore doing rope access for just over, a little over seven years. I'm much happier uh, working at home, working around Simon, Gabs, and Luke and Tom. It's, uh, oh, it's so much better. When will Harry enter his first strongman competition? Quite a few questions like that, so I'll just group them all into, into one. Um, it's not something I've thought about in too much kind of detail. I'm not where I want to be uh, with my training yet. I've got a lot, like a lot to learn and I need to get a lot stronger before I kind of think about jumping into the competition thing. My second year seriously training, like consistent training before that, it was off and on due to working offshore and stuff like that. I don't want to rush into things um, just because my second name's Stoltman. Um, still got to put in up. All the, work, all the work, like grind it out, everything. I'll think about it. Favorite event. I started training events a few months ago and my favorite would probably, probably be the Stones just now. I really enjoy them. I like all of it, but just now I think this, the Stones is my favorite and it's a pretty badass, badass event. We're doing a Becoming a Strongman series on YouTube. Uh, we're on episode three, so go and check that out. It's, uh, it's quite interesting to see beginner working and progressing up until hopefully uh, a strongman, fingers crossed. Do you feel added pressure to compete and be good at it because of how well Luke and Tom have done? No, it's kind of like the, the other question, not really. I'm doing this because I want to try it. Personally, I want to see how far I can go. If I try it and don't become anything, then at least I tried it and at least I know I'm happy in myself and I've given it my all. It really it's just really good fun and I enjoy it, I love it. Um, and to get to train with Luke and Tom is 
That's like my dream come to, true, you know? Is he a shagger? Question <laughs> mark. <laughs> it's not really for me to answer, is it? <laughs> Simon? Are you? <laughs> no comment. How far is Harry wanting to go in Strongman? And sickest brothers, my idols. As far as my body will take me, I don't plan on stopping anytime soon. This is a long-term thing. It's not just train for a year, compete. And then that's it over and done with. I want this to be progressive. Single question mark. Yes, very much single. And uh, I aim to keep it that way. Apologies, ladies. He looks like a combination of the two of you, to be honest. And the height as well. Interesting. Not a question, but yeah. Um, they are my brother, so some similarities to them. People at the start thought I was adopted or they didn't think I was a, a real Stoltman brother. Which is quite interesting, but... There you go. My favourite colour, black. Do you think you could ever get to the same level as Tom and Luke? Don't see why not. Um, if I put the, the work into it, the, the effort into it, I can go as far as I want to. What's it like having to babysit your two older brothers? That's a full time job in itself. I try my best with it. <laughs> I think I'm doing pretty good. What motivated Harry to move into Strongman? Or was it simply Stoltman destiny? When Luke and Tom first started competing, I went to the gym, 15, 16, 17 it was. And I went to the gym off and on like after school, but I wasn't as dedicated to it as them. Like I enjoyed it and it was fun, but I didn't, didn't think I'd ever do anything with it. Just over a year ago, I went through a messy divorce, a horrible experience. Found out my wife was having an affair with my best friend and that really like just shifted everything in my brain. Changed my whole outlook on life. Yeah, really kind of knocked me back. So then I, I decided I could go two ways. I could go down the, the kind of dark path, you know, like just drinking, drugs, whatever, and kind of just wasting, wasting the opportunity that, that I have. Or I could make something of the potential that I have. Um, obviously the, the genes are good, the genetics are good, and I decided there and then that I want to start, start taking tra uh, training serious and ever since then just been progressing slowly and yeah that's kind of where it's all stemmed from and onwards and upwards. Since starting your strongman journey how have you altered your diet? That was probably the hardest thing uh, to change was the diet and how much you actually have to eat to to put on muscle. It was a bit of a shock to me I'm with uh, Nathan. He's been really really helpful uh, writing my diet plan and stuff the main uh, the main surprise was just how how much i've got to eat you know a lot of mints a lot of rice a lot of veg it's good it's made me become a better cook because of it do different meals not not uh, get bo bored of it of the same stuff favorite song and favorite artist i like a varied amount of music but just now anything by juice world that's who i keep going back to what would be your advice getting started in a in strongman in a regular gym i'm not really sure because i train in obviously the strength center which is it's got um a lot of strongman stuff so it's not really maybe you should ask dan he's he's more the person to to speak to about that but just focus on your your, your main main lifts, your compound lifts, get stronger and then if the gym decides to get some strongman stuff then you'll be in a pretty good position there. How tall are you? We'll get Simon to measure me. Okay guys, Simon's here with the tape measure and he's gonna measure me. Let's do it. <laughs> Eight foot. Get it nice and straight. Oh jeez, there's a total water. Wait, check the floor. Is it, yeah, that's is true. It, it's straight, is it? Get the tallest part of my hand. 196. 196. What's the body weight goal? Just now I'm 126 kilos. Last year I was, what was I, 100 and 112, I think I was. Uh, so the next goal is 130. I want to put four kilograms of good weight on rather than just dirty bulking. Do you want to compete in World's Strongest Man? Yeah, of course I do. That's That'll be the dream. A lot of work. So so much hours I need to put in and uh, I'm really looking forward to putting in that, that work. Age, 26 years old. Straight, question mark. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm straight. Yeah, sorry boys. Is Harry a natty? Yes, I'm very much natural. <laughs> um, this is basically my second year of consistent training and I've made some really, really good gains and they're continuing to progress. So 
it would be silly to, to jump on gear when you've got so much to learn. But it's not really something I've thought about. Who was the most annoying sibling growing up? <laughs> I think we all know the answer to that. Tom, big Tommy. He was uh, mad into his wrestling and I always got the brunt force of it. I'd be fighting in the living room on the trampoline, breaking stuff. Oh, he broke my thumb once. He jumped on my thumb and broke it. What was the move that he did? Uh, I can't remember. It's the one where you go like that. Who knows, it was a long time ago. I'm not gonna answer this one, but does he have health well or some problems? <laughs> <laughs> That's savage. Oh. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> Why is he called Harry? Question mark. He doesn't have that much hair, LOL. <laughs> I don't get it, do you? Harry. No one pronounces it like that. I though. know. <laughs> <laughs> Okay guys, I think that's uh, all the questions. There's a couple of duplicate uh, questions. Hopefully you enjoyed it, hopefully you learnt a wee bitty. Keep liking, keep commenting, subscribing. If you like the Becoming a Strongman series, um, keep following that. There's there's uh, a few good videos going to be coming out. The next one, episode 4, will be a full day eating. It'll be quite interesting, so yeah, stay tuned. Don't forget, smile, stay safe, stay spicy.